As Libby Kirsch reports, the Montgomery County Cold Case Squad is now getting involved. <laughs> This was a horrible crime, uh, cold-blooded, premeditated. He shot Kevin from behind and gave him absolutely no chance to defend himself. In the six years since their son Kevin, a Dayton police officer, was murdered, Rosemary and Gerald Brame haven't stopped campaigning to find Kevin's killer, even talking to the Dayton City Commission. Losing Kevin is a tragedy from which we will never recover, and we will never rest until his killers are brought to justice. It was November 1st, 1999. Kevin, off duty at the time, was dropping his two small children off at their mother's home on Cherry Drive. He was ambushed, shot from behind, and left to die. I am convinced, beyond any doubt, that there are persons out there in the Dayton area that know about Kevin's death, they know who murdered Kevin, and they know why Kevin was murdered. But still six years have passed with few developments. In 2003, police searched the home of a former co-worker of Kevin's wife, but no arrests were made. Now the Montgomery County Cold Case Squad will join in on the investigation to help find out who killed Kevin Brame. I live every minute in fear, not for me, but for my family. Because there's somebody out there that took our son's life. And if you're bold enough to take a policeman's life, then I don't know what would stop them from harming my family. The reward for information leading to an arrest in the Kevin Brame homicide investigation now stands at $100,000. You can call Crime Stoppers at 222-STOP with any tips. And remember, you can remain anonymous and still be eligible for that cash reward. In Dayton, I'm Libby Kirsch, 2 News on your side.